Well, I walk into the gym and, you know, obviously I have such an effect on women. They love me. They look at me, they say, oh, look at him. He's so cute. His nose wiggles when he smiles and he has such nice chest hair. And so, and then Jeff walks in, they're like, look at him. He's like tall, awkward, and like everyone thinks he's a loser. You know, Drake's a great guy. But man, he sucks at volleyball. I don't want to break hearts today. People are going to fall in love with me. That's just who I am. I'm a beautiful person on the inside and the outside. I'm a world-class athlete. So, you know, I'm just hoping that they come out of it okay. That's just not encouraging. <laughs> All right. We're going to dominate. Two UBC editors emerge from the bowels of the sub to take on two of UBC's most elite athletes. They'll be facing off against two national champions, Rael Queering and Kylo Ritchie. First to 15. Jeff is someone that I know through other people and you know at first I thought he was going to be a nice guy and then the more I got to know him the more I thought about the reading on Facebook. You know I played like, some good high school beach volleyball. thinking that I could have scored a lot more points if Jeff wasn't there because I was carrying the team. Um, you know, his awkwardness really, really hurt us. And morale was down because, you know, when you're playing with someone like that, who you just like look at you like, oh God, I hate you. I mean, you're just not going to have good team chemistry and that's, that's what Jeff brought to the table. I will have to say that during the game, I might have been incredibly hungover. I'm not going to hold that against me because it wasn't my choice to be that way. That's just what chemically happens when you drink a large amount of booze. strong team and you know we really had to play every single point because you never know when they can come back. And the sneak attack weapons were uh, coming in hard so um, we had to be ready defensively. We just talk about it later. Seriously. Honestly. Uh, head is killing me. Way too hungover for this job.